Hey guys, Solano here and welcome back to Play to Earn. If you don't have a lot of time to play every day, but still want that feeling of leveling up and making progress in your games, then idle games could be right up your alley. With these games, you just need to check in every now and then and still enjoy the full experience. And with the integration of blockchain, you can even earn rewards while doing so. Here are five free to play idle games that you can add to your list. The first game on our list is Crypto Ball Z. Crypto Ball Z is an idle RPG being built on Wii Mix. Crypto Ball Z combines shooting game mechanics with idle RPG elements. In this game, players can use their unique heroes and commanders for a chance to earn rewards while playing. The game is free to play for anyone to try, and all players start with a tier 1 novice. As you play the game, you can get more novices. When you get novices of the same tier, you combine them to level them up. Once you combine two tier 10 novices, they transform into a hero. The hero you get when fusing is random, so just hope you have good luck and get a rare one. Heroes are more powerful and will help you beat more enemies as you get further into the game. They come in three rarities which are rare, super rare, and super super rare. The way to earn in this game is by placing on the seasonal leaderboards. The higher the stage you get to by the end of the season, the more rewards you can get. The stages get progressively harder, which is where getting good heroes matters the most. As you get more novices and fuse them, you get better heroes. And as you upgrade your heroes and form your best team, the further you can get into the game. As you progress, you can also send drones to go on searches, which can also get you rewards when they return. By playing the game, you can earn Herco and Hero Stone, the game's two tokens. These are both trainable on Wii Mix. The game is available now on Google Play Store if you want to check it out. For even more info, you could check their website and socials in the description below. The next game on our list is Sunflower Land. Sunflower Land is a farming and mining simulation game being built on Polygon. Sunflower Land is a game where you can farm, trade, and craft NFTs in a vibrant and colorful world. In Sunflower Land, you can gather resources and craft rare in-game NFTs. These NFTs are not just cosmetic items, they have actual utility and value in the game. For example, you can craft tools, weapons, potions, clothing, furniture, and even buildings. You can trade these NFTs with other players or on various secondary markets. You can also use them to complete deliveries at Pumpkin Plaza, dig for treasure at the beach, mix potions in the woodlands, fish in the depths from marine marvels, and more. Sunflower Land is not just a static game, it is constantly evolving and introducing new features and mechanics. Each season brings new adventures and challenges for you to explore and enjoy. You can also collect rare resources and items that are only available in each season. Since the rewards change with the seasons, you should plan accordingly if you want to get everything. Sunflower Land is a play to own game, which means that you own your assets and can earn rewards by playing the game. You can also participate in the governance of the game by voting on proposals and suggestions. There are also new areas including volcanic terrain and the swamplands for players to explore. If you are interested in playing Sunflower Land, you can visit their website and sign up for free. You can also follow their social media in the description below for the latest updates. Liking this list so far? Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe to our channel so you're always updated with play to earn idle games. And now let's get straight back to the list. The next game on our list is Zip Clash. Zip Clash is an idle simulation game being built on the blockchain. Zip Clash is a casual clicker idle game that is easy and free to play. The main focus of the game is by maximizing the profits of their planet's restaurants in their given galaxies by using a variety of boosters and other items. Once you start the game from scratch, the game will spare a free planet and you can use this planet to progress in the game. You can also continue upgrading the same planet by adding boosters. However, players can buy more customized planets from the marketplace aside from the free planet. Planets are divided into three rarities which are common, rare, and wonder. Players can also access boosters that can help their planet's production, these being the planet booster and the galaxy booster. Planet boosters can be donated to players for free or bought from the marketplace. There are also production building boosters, vehicle boosters, and even manager boosters to help manage your restaurant. Boosters are also upgradable to increase their effectiveness. You can then rinse and repeat this process across several planets until you have a whole ecosystem of planets producing passive income for you. The game is playable now if you want to try it out. For even more info, you can check their website and socials in the description below. The next game on our list is S4 Kingdom. S for Kingdom is a fantasy and idle MMORPG being built on Phantom. S for Kingdom is a browser-based idle adventure blockchain game with a medieval fantasy theme that offers 100% blockchain-based gameplay, NFTs, chainlink oracles, and a deflationary in-game economy with their own token called Brush. 
The gameplay involves creating heroes, fighting monsters, crafting weapons, mining minerals, and other activities that will level up their heroes' individual skills and earn them items. Players can buy and sell a variety of these items through the in-game shop with the brush token or trade them as NFTs. The game has over 350 unique items to collect, so if you are a fan of collect-a-thon games, this could be right up your alley. The game is similar to many browser-based idle games in the past that garnered millions of players worldwide, but this has an idle-type gameplay to it. Actions in the game can be set to run for up to 24 hours, and up to three actions can be queued for your heroes, allowing their passive progression. Activities in the game can involve wood cutting, fire making, fishing, and cooking, and there is even thieving, fletching, mining, and alchemy. You can choose which activities you want your heroes to do in the background. There are also quests you can do to gain rewards like XP and materials, and there is even a clan system if you want to play with your friends from around the world. The game is playable now if you want to try it out. For even more info, you can check their website and socials in the description below. The last game on our list is Pocket Space. Pocket Space is an idle arcade game being built on Solana and Sui. Pocket Space is the first idle arcade played own game that has a multiplayer mode. It's a sandbox game with building and crafting elements set in a space fantasy universe. You can explore, mine, craft, trade, and compete with other players. You can own your own galaxy and customize it with different planets, stars, and buildings. You can also visit other players' planets and mine resources, complete tasks, and earn rewards and chests. You can trade your assets for in-game currency on a public marketplace, or use them to participate in seasonal competitions and PvP battles. You can see how your pocket universe plays out over time, intervene like a god with physics tools to affect the orbit of planets, heat them up, cool them down, or explode them. The game also has its own player-powered economy that revolves around users' actions. The flow of the economy involves the resource mining, the crafting of different equipment, and of course, the player-owned planets. You can also visit other players' planets and invite them to check out yours. You can collect rare resources alone or with others to create items or participate in PvP battles with bets. The game is playable now if you want to try it out. For even more info, you can check their website and socials in the description below. And that's a wrap for today's list of games. If you were looking for play to earn idle games that you could try for free, then I hope this video helped. And for even more info on everything about blockchain games, check out our website at playtoearn.com, where we have the largest database of games that have all the info you need. That's it for today. See you in the next video.